Welcome to the Freddie and Paul Show. This is episode number 13. We've got wow. Philip in this week. No Nancy. Nancy's sick, so Nancy can't be here. We've got <laughs> Philip in here. We've got Freddie. Uh -huh. Say hello to everybody, Fred. Hey, how you guys doing out there? we got our show going on, and I hope you tune in because by the grace of God, we can, all do, we can do all things through Christ that's strengthening us. In Jesus' name, you got the floor, Paul. Okay. Go ahead, Philip. Yeah, gotta... and this is love. And... <laughs> I gave a, a magnet uh, that fits on your refrigerator, says Jesus, and I had an envelope. I gave it to a man, he said, uh, I don't know you, and I said, he opened the, uh, the envelope and he saw it says Jesus, and I said, that, wow. he, that, Jesus knows you, and he said, yeah, and then he comes back and said, yeah, he did, he was wow. in Vietnam, and uh, God took care of him and, and while he was in Vietnam. So, okay, I'll open it. That's what happens when I give out a Jesus sign. That's cool to people. That's cool. There's a, there's a Jesus sign. Oh, right. right. On. The new one. And I got a Bible verse on top and bottom right. now. The okay. new ones. So, Phil continues to perfect his Jesus sign. Uh, what do you think of this whole thing, Freddie? You think this I is think a good thing? I think it's awesome. Yeah? It, what do you like about it? I like it that the way you look at it, you got to really concentrate on what it says on there. But once you say, see what it says on there, you have to uh, explain yourself and you have to make sure you're walking the Christian life because if you're not walking the Christian life, well then you're improving, improvement needed and you should walk the Christian life and you should look at the Jesus sign. And if you have Jesus, you can do all things through Christ that strengthens you. Okay, all right. And I was on the, in a few years ago, I was in Denver and the Lord spoke to me and saying I need to write, uh, uh, give a sign out. So I had to write it on a piece of plastic I had on the train and a man wanted to want the, uh, the, the Jesus sign. I said, you give me your address and I sent it to him. Wow. And uh, four hours later, uh, he was thrown off the train because he was drunk. Uh oh. So. <laughs> I, that was a miracle. If I didn't live up to uh, the drunken part, wasn't a miracle. No, but uh, it was a miracle that I gave it to him. That's true. But, That's true. Uh, and it was that I had to listen to the Lord. If if I did not uh, make the sign and give it to the guy, he would never would have got it. So, got to listen to the Lord. And the sign speaks to people. Mm -hmm. Even when that person's cussing, he sees it. He will quit cussing. Okay. Okay. All right. Anything else? Well, that pretty much sizes up. Uh, tune in next week when we'll have more to talk about. And uh, we got we got the coffee special, and we got the C.S. Lewis rap. We're still looking forward Lewis to. C.S. Lewis rap next week, next Sunday, or next Sunday, or maybe church. during the week. We'll see. We'll see, or whenever we can get to it. And thank you for tuning in, everybody. Catch and on you the flip side. Have a wonderful day. One, come on, come on. One, one love. See, I'm getting the whole love, thing down one now. Love. <laughs> All right. Thank you very much.